Hello, today we're at Tube River Rage in Townsend, Tennessee. We're gonna hop in an inner tube and float down the river. Have a nice relaxing day. Take you along with us. I did get a GoPro. I will be able to film on our little adventure today. And I hope you have a great time. This is our last day here with our friends. So we're just looking for a nice relaxing day. We are Kim and Aaron, and this is Zach and Cody. We are best friends living and traveling full time in our renovated RV, Lucy. We have been on the road since October 2020, so please subscribe to join in on all the fun. RV TV, K and E on V T V. Sing it with us. This place claims to have the longest float and the best tubes. I'm gonna try and give you a shot of the tubes. I think you float down the river in this green bus right here. It takes you back up to your car here. Plus they have life jackets if you need them. And here are the tubes. There are these big tubes with a net bottom. So for all you people who are afraid of creatures in the creek, you got that net there to protect you. They drop us right at the entrance to the Great Smoky Mountain National Park. And it's raining, guys. Who's excited for the rain and the freezing cold water? Yeah. This is our tube. And they also give everyone a life jacket. You don't have to wear it, but they give you a life jacket. All right, guys. Let's go freeze our butts off. Okay. So the people said you have to take a life jacket. You don't have to wear it, but use it as a backrest. So that's what we're gonna do. See how it works. <laughs> and uh, yeah, see how it works. And I brought this string and I tied my GoPro to it and I have like a waterproof thing on it. So hopefully we're all good. So let's go play in the rain. Freeze our butts off. Yay. 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 <laughs> she jumped it on her stomach because she doesn't want to get wet. This water is 66 degrees oh. and it's raining. <laughs> <laughs> we're nuts. <laughs> we're doing it for the tube. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm going the wrong way. Wait, I need a stick. I need a stick. I'm gonna get stuck on the rocks. Oh, I'm stuck already. I gotta go. Does it get better? I'm stuck on the rocks. Oh man, I'm stuck on the rocks. You gotta lift your butt up. Oh boy. So, at the beginning there, it was a little rocky and a little shallow, so uh, we had to maneuver our way around the rocks, which wasn't fun, but now it's uh, moving a little quicker. It is still pouring. I brought my hat for the sun, but I'm actually kind of glad because it's blocking the rain, so it's great. I'm so stuck again. Ugh. We finally just got out of that rocky part again. The rocky parts are like not fun. I wanted a nice relaxing ride, which we are getting right now in the rain. Ooh, I just hit a rock. They got a rope swing here. Backflip! Yeah. <laughs> that looks so fun. My friends left me. I'm all alone. We should have tied together. I mean, this is a, it's actually really nice. Like, you get used to the water uh, pretty quickly, so I'm not even cold at all, actually. 
You want me to paddle to you? This is supposed to be relaxing. <laughs> Got my water shoes. Good to go. If anybody had a cocktail right now, that'd be great. I made it to Aaron. Hi, friend. Are you enjoying yourself? I'm used to it now, so I'm not. I know cold you're. Not, I'm not cold, right? Exactly. I guess this is the initial shock. Yeah, the initial uh, shock. But it's really sure. Yeah. Look, there's sun is trying to peek through a little blue. Yay! Hopefully the sun comes out. Hi, friends! I finally made it to you. Are you having fun? You glad the rain stopped? Not a while. You should not for me. Uh huh. To the bottom. What do you think? It's about like two feet here, two and a half feet. We were just talking. Somebody should be like selling hot dogs on the side of the river with some beer. That we can make a killing. Let's start a business. <laughs> we are coming up on some kind of little rapids. You know what's gonna happen. Hope we don't get stuck. Oh my gosh, just went into the tree. <laughs> Aaron got stuck up there. Come on, Aaron, you can do it. I think Aaron and Christina are coming down the rapids now. Hands up, hands up. Oh god. <laughs> Go down some rapids, that's for sure. There's a little bit more rapids. Oh, I'm coming up right straight to a rock. Oh, God. Oh, no. <laughs> oh. The trick is to lift your butt up if you come under some rocks. Ooh. Aaron, you're supposed to go jump off of that rock right there. I can't even stop this thing if I want this trip. I know. Oh, Lordy, here we go. I'm gonna have to lift my butt. Oh, that's a rock. Oh, I think I'm stuck. Bye oh, bye. Oh, well, that wasn't fun. I had to get out of my tube and walk it a little bit back to the middle where the current is stronger and a little deeper. So be prepared for that. You might have to get out your tubes. All depends on the water level. And now my friends left me again. <laughs> That's my best friend. She waited for me. Now I'm passing you. Come on. Look at the skies now. Like completely different. So crazy. Like, would y'all know it was just pouring down rain on us a few minutes ago? So nuts. Okay, bye, Erin. There's <laughs> a bunch of camping chairs out here. I don't know if it's uh, from all these people staying in these little cabins and stuff over here. I think we're coming up on some more rapids. I see everybody having to stand up. So, I think that's what's going to happen to get through this little part. There's a big old log right in the middle, too. Low tree. Oh, boy. I'm going to get stuck. Come on, let's do it. Oh no, 
Did you make it? Okay, we at least we didn't have to get out of our tube. We just got stuck for a little second. Aaron showed me the way. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh no, oh, there's the box. You gotta get your butt up. Eric is telling. Backwards is so funny, you never know when you're gonna smash into a rock. Oh no, Eric! Oh no! Ah! Oh, I just like bounced off that rock real quick. Oh, okay. That was easy. Oh, Aaron's stuck. Come on, Aaron! You can do it! Oh! Ow! Oh, am I stuck? Come on, let's go. Keep going! Oh. <laughs> I tried to wait for air and then I got myself stuck over here. Alright, we're going down some rapids here. Woo! Oh no! Holy crap! Oh my god! <laughs> Jump in! Hurry! Jump in! <laughs> oh, I'm coming right to you. <laughs> we're about to be stuck together. Uh, it's like the rapid parts are fun, but the getting stuck parts oh, are not fun at all. Annoying, yeah. It makes it so less relaxing. So. <laughs> Wee! Bye, friends. Bye. Thanks for waiting. Oh, when you're not going through the rocky parts, it's so relaxing. So. The competitor to the company we're using is River Rat, so it's yellow tubes. But those tubes have no netting, and they're like bigger and fatter, and ours are like this better, stronger material. I don't know how to describe it, but I think these tubes that we have are better than the River Rat tubes. Coming up on a little bit of acid. Oh! He used to stay away from the shore, which I am not that good at. I can hear some more rapids coming up. <laughs> oh, look at this. It's just gorgeous. Are you stuck? Yeah. <laughs> I think I'm about to get stuck myself. Ooh, rock. I need to push myself in the middle. The key is getting yourself into the middle where the current is. Oh boy. We're spinning and bouncing off of rocks. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> It's like a ride. Oh no. You can do it. You can do it. Oh boy. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. <laughs> We're going through some more rapids. <laughs> It always finds the baby to the side and I try to stay in the middle. Oh no. I don't want to go that way. I don't want to go that way. Oh no. Oh. I don't want to go that way. Oh, it's making me go this way. Oh, I don't think I'm going to get stuck. Oh. 
I'm like stuck over here now. <sighs> Ooh, I just made it through that hole. I'm worried about my dang tube popping. In. <laughs> They're really thick, but I definitely think it could be possible. Uh, we were just talking about um, how the weather was bad when we first got in, but we didn't have a choice because we had already paid and been dropped off, and then as soon as we got dropped off, it started pouring. So if we would have waited a little bit later, and it would have started raining, we probably would have just not even done this. But we're so glad that we went at the time we did, stuck out the rain because it is absolutely beautiful out. Look at these rocks over here, so cool. What do you think is hiding in those holes? Black bears. Black bears. <laughs> <laughs> Christina's pissed. She hasn't seen a black bear the whole trip. Not one, but it's their mascot. <laughs> yeah, she's like, there's black bears everywhere, but yet I haven't seen one. Well, we've only seen two since we've been here almost two months, right? That's not enough to make it their mascot. <laughs> <laughs> but they're here. Aaron, you're so far away. <laughs> It's so chill, so quiet, so relaxing. Look how clear the water is. Oopsie. I made it back to Erin. Come with me. Come with me if you want to live. <laughs> Teamwork makes the dream work. And there's like nobody out here with us really either. Like we have our own private river tour. <laughs> it's gorgeous. Gorgeous. And the sun feels great. I just wish we had a cooler with some adult beverages. Yeah. That would help. This part is pretty slow moving. It's great. You can even get out of your tube if you wanted to and just float down next to your tube in the water. If you wanted to cool off a little bit, it's actually hot now. I was even thinking about it. So we've been floating down this really slow part for a while. I understand why they said longest ride because the river right exit was way before this. So I definitely think you get better tubes and a longer ride. Remember to put sunscreen on your legs. I didn't do it. Not really burn too bad though, but I know a lot of people do. So your legs are like up out of the water the whole time. So make sure you put some sunscreen on them. I'm going to put the camera in the water to see if you see any fishes. Not, but we have seen a couple so we're coming up on our exit over here there's a big sign that says two river rage exit only and they also have this big eagle water flow out in the water that was our biggest sign we knew this is where we're supposed to get off so we just got out the river and we had a cooler packed in the car already they told us they had picnic tables that you could pack lunch and eat out here so that's what we did so now we're gonna grab some lunch so when we um, first checked in and paid for our rafting, well, it's called rafting tubing, I should say, um, they tell you to lock everything that you're gonna have in your car because they don't have lockers here, but they will hold your car key for you. So you don't have to worry about your car key getting wet or losing exactly. your car key or anything yeah. like that. You don't have to pay for lockers, so it's kind of mm -hmm. nice. Uh, I recommend bringing water shoes if you do have water shoes. Absolutely. There's definitely a few parts. Uh, down the way that you have to get out of your tube because it's so shallow and so yeah. rocky that you can't you get stuck we yeah. got stuck quite a few times <laughs> <laughs> but 
We definitely did get stuck. I feel like my arms are sore already from <laughs> trying to maneuver ourselves around the rocks. It's still but, fun though, especially uh, when you hit the little rapid areas. Yeah, the rapid parts are fun. Really fun. And then, then there's a bunch of calm areas when you just go really mm -hmm. slow and it's super relaxing. relaxing. So the whole thing's not relaxing, but some of it is. Yeah. <laughs> So you get the best of both worlds, but I, I, I agree with that. What do you think? I wouldn't recommend like any like older people trying to do this, do you? I mean, if you're in, if you know, if you're, if in, you're shape, in shape enough to be able, to yeah, like not in shape because we're not in yeah, shape. Yeah, we're not in shape. But you know, if you're able, mm -hmm. I think it'd be all right. Yeah, you have to be at least eight years or six years old. I'm sorry, six years old, six year old to be able to even do the tubing. Mm -hmm. so just an FYI, if you have smaller kids. We had a great time. Yeah. So now we're gonna sit and have a little picnic lunch. Yeah. And highly recommend. I think this place would be better than River Rat. The tubes were awesome. Yeah, the tubes they are were huge, bigger, wider. Netting. They have a net. Yeah. And I feel like it's a longer, a longer, a longer, like, yeah, ride longer down ride well. down as mm. well. So definitely recommend this place for mm -hmm. sure. So they do allow you to do the run all over again for free if you want to, but it all depends on how busy it is out, and sometimes you uh, have to go on a waiting list. So they have to wait for more tubes to come back in. So this is where you get out, right over here. They help you out and everything. There's, they pull you up to little stairs and help you out. You don't have to like plop in the water or anything. They have some Jenga here, some tiki, tiki torches, a fire pit. They have Connect Four in the front. Oh yeah, they have like a big giant Connect Four in the front. That's awesome. They also have picnic tables where you can uh, bring your lunch just like we did today it worked out great we uh did our first trip down the river then we stopped and had a little picnic lunch and then we hopped right back in and did another trip down the river so this is what the water looks like after the torrential downpour that happened right before our second ride <laughs> and at the beginning of our second ride we literally were in a torrential downpour worse than the first time thunderstorming lightning all around us we had to get off the river and we huddled inside of some rv park in this little mm -hmm. gazebo Did for a little bit and hung out till the rain minutes, stopped until, the lightning yeah, stopped until the lightning calmed down a bit so we felt a little safer yeah but it made the water levels rise so much higher all the dirt yeah than, we, than it did the first ride so our second ride was way quicker than the first yeah we got down way one well, much faster than the yeah first much faster just a little FYI, make sure you put your sunscreen on, bring your sunglasses, bring your hat, and most importantly, water shoes. Yes, water shoes. Yeah, and if you're brave enough, you could uh, try to sneak a beverage or two down the, down the river. We did the second trip. Because they have like the netting in the tube, so you could just uh, put a little drink in there and it holds it just fine, won't fall out the bottom. Another plus of these tubes. <laughs> They have this cool map here that with this arrow here on the side that you can take pictures with and point to where you're from. They have bathrooms here with some uh, changing rooms and stuff like that as well so you can get uh, dried off after getting wet. This is where they have the tube. They only have so many tubes so make sure you get here early or else you get put on a waiting list and you gotta wait for people to come down so you can get their tubes. So we decided to take a second run down the river. Mm -hmm. If you purchase um, your ride for the day, if they're not on a wait when you're finished, or you know later on, if you you know mm -hmm. say you pack your lunch and you have your little picnic when you're done, you can go down again mm -hmm. if they're not on a wait. So yeah. luckily for us, they weren't on a wait, so we did it again. Mm -hmm. Started torrentially downpouring soon as we got in the river. Mm -hmm. We had to pull off worse than the first time. Yeah, we had to pull off a little bit down because it, it got mm -hmm. so bad. But we had a great time. It was it was mm -hmm. faster because the water level yep. rose so much when mm -hmm. it gets stuck as many yeah. rocks. I didn't even have to get out the second yeah. time. Yeah, I think it, it was, was great. But the water just looks like chuck enough now. Which yeah, is, it was like it was, crystal clear mm -hmm. the first time, and then now it looks dirty and gross, and all the rain runs off the mountain into the river. Mm -hmm. So it made it pretty gross. Yeah, <laughs> but more fun. But definitely more, more fun. More thrilling, I should say. Yeah. <laughs> We had a great time here. Yeah. Definitely think you should come check this place out. I think out. we might come back before we leave. I don't yeah. know. We had a great time. We love the tubes, the yeah. size of the tubes, oh, yeah. the, net and the netting in the tubes. I think like, that's the best part. I mean, we, mm -hmm. we looked a couple videos up about the river rat in here, mm -hmm. and we figured we saw the tubes, they had the netting, yep. that we liked that they were really large, that the actual, your row, your length down the river is longer yeah, the than longer, it would be for a river rat. Longer ride here, yep. And everybody here has been super, super sweet. Yeah, the All the people working here 
family. Great. Yeah. So. so highly recommend it. Come check this place out. Two thumbs up. For sure. <laughs> so give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video and comment if you've ever gone tubing before or any other cool tubing places you think yeah. we should check out. And subscribe. If you're new here. Yep. We'll see you in the next episode. Have a good day. Bye.